Natural hazards have adverse impact on basic city services, their infrastructures, housing, human livelihoods and health. Changing climate has severely impacted us all. Our cities need more support to manage the crisis. The government tries to minimize loss and damage. The researchers tries to calibrate the climate challenges and find a solution. The private sector tries to minimize the adverse economic impact and the citizen groups encourage social welfare. What if all the stakeholders work together for climate resilience? Any collective on-ground climate action, decision or processes that enhances climate resilience becomes a participatory climate action. Believe it or not, this is happening. In Kerala, students and teachers are actively engaged in collecting data to monitor rainfall levels. This helps assess possible flooding and landslide situations. It has also been aiding city administrators to take quicker action and has helped communities to respond sooner. Similarly, Swayam Shikshan Prayog, an Indian NGO, trains rural women in entrepreneurship and builds their capacity for marketing clean energy projects. Currently, 1100 women entrepreneurs are working across eight districts in India. They are helping in cutting greenhouse gas emissions by making clean energy products accessible to their community. Have you experienced something similar in your city? Or do you think your city can have a participatory approach for climate related challenges? Now we want to know from you. Tell us more about such initiatives in this survey. Part 1 of the form gathers your opinion on its component. Part 2 of the form tries to understand the sector-based challenges and potentials. Fill the form now. We look forward for your inputs. Let's build a climate-resilient world together.